What's up, players? What's going on, guys? This is Zendu Nation. This is Dan Whitmer, and today I'm going to show you how to jump rope like a pro. You know, like a pro, kind of like me, sort of like me when I almost went to the NFL for wide receiver. I'm just kidding. I didn't even make it close to the NFL, so. In today's video, we've been getting a lot of questions in the YouTube community just asking for more videos on different variations of how to jump rope, and so we wanted to make this a part of that series. You're gonna learn a simple sequence of tricks which I'll break down one by one, and then show you them repeatedly together so that you can see what they look like. Now, if you're a beginner, I recommend trying these out, and even trying each of the individual uh, exercises that I'm about to show you out, not just the string of them, but don't feel discouraged if you can't get this on the first try, guys. And some of you already know this, but for those of you who don't, we run a free four-week jump rope challenge that includes daily interaction with Brandon and myself. Check it out, it's in the link below. Let's have some fun. First up, we're gonna show you the jump rope regular bounce, of course, which is just the basic step. Next up, we have the side swipe. Next, we have the double under. And to finish the sequence, we have the crisscross. Here's the side swipe and regular bounce together. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so to start things off, we're just going regular bounce and side swipe. So regular bounce, elbows are in, hands shutting out to the sides of hips. I'm up on my toes. And now when I do the side swipe, I'm going regular bounce every few and then swinging that right hand over and then my left hand over. So right hand comes under, left hand comes over. As a reminder, if you want individual tutorials on the side swipe or regular bounce, click those a couple seconds ago that I just showed you. Here is the side swipe, the double under, and regular bounce together. All right, guys, now we're gonna add in the double under. So after you do the side swipe, you're gonna bounce like regular bounce for just a little bit longer. So there's a side swipe, little bit of a regular bounce, like one or two, and then I go right into the double under. So don't feel like you need to go right into the double under right away if you're not comfortable with it. Do a little regular bounce, a little side swipe, and then I go one, two, and then on the third or fourth one, that's when I do my double under. And lastly, you have all four in the same sequence, the regular bounce, the side swipe, the double under, the crisscross. All right, guys, so here is the full sequence of moves. This will be a little bit longer. You'll be able to see this a few times. I'm going regular. Then I go right hand, left hand cross. I jump twice in between my double under, and then as soon as I land, as I'm coming down from my double under, when that rope hits, look, down, I cross, okay? So here's another angle in slow-mo. There's my side swipe, couple bounces, double under, and as soon as that rope comes around again, um, when I'm coming down from the double under, I simply cross my hands and let the momentum of the rope come around as it crosses. So double under. Now notice when I do this crisscross. Let's check it out again. Regular bounce, side swipe, couple bounces, double and then look how the rope just effortlessly comes back around because I've torqued it so much doing the double under. Now on this last one, we're gonna do, this is for more advanced people. This sequence gives no space in between um, the, sorry, side swipe and double under. I go right into it, so check this out. Go in regular mount, side swipe, and bam, right there, I open up my rope right away rather than getting a few hops in. So again, this is more of an advanced move, but let's check it out again right, left, and open, bam, double under, and crossover. Been awesome, guys. We'll see you on the next tutorial. Let us know if you got questions, know what I mean?